Welcome back to Let's Play XCOM, Enemy Unknown. I'm Hunter Black Luna, and we're about to get some nice things. Also, like half the roster is on six le sick leave. Six weeks of leave. Honestly, we couldn't spare anyone for that long. Panic? Mm, panic's a thing. But us whooping alien ass is also a thing. I think I mentioned this, but if I get a satellite now, it won't be there before the council report, so I'll just be out the money. Just like time passed for a little bit. Nice. Carapace armor. Apparently I have no means of replicating it on Earth. Okay, we need alien alloys for it. Substantially better protection. Well, that sounds good to me. The nav computer. Reducing research time by 50%. Development of ship based cannons for our interceptors as well. Yeah, no kidding. We need so many weapon fragments for these. I'm not even sure how many weapon fragments we actually have at the moment. Um, at this point, let's interrogate the floater. It doesn't cost anything. I have no clue what we're going to learn from it, but that's why we do it. Hope you enjoy your time with the good doctor. Doctor. Doctor Shen. Hmm. Is this worth it? Well. Yes. Yes, it is. We can make four suits of armor. Means we can give it to almost the entire team. And yes, that is worth spending just about every penny. And like all our alloys. Uh, yeah, just like in classic XCOM, better armor for the troops isn't something that's optional. We gotta get this. We just gotta get this. Now we don't have the money for anything else. But I'm cool with it. And we'll have another satellite in orbit. Uh... I'll have to decide where, the, where to place the satellite. And I'm gonna decide now. Because I'd rather like to have an interceptor Oh, I can't get an interceptor there anyway. Okay. In that case, I may place it in a continent I already have something, but that won't really work either. Ah, uh, upshot is we'll figure it the hell out. The satellite coverage now available over the United Kingdom. Yay! Raven One is back up. What did we learn from the floater? Basic armor attack. Oh. Basic armor attack. Is that literal? Skeleton suit. Climbing grapple. Ooh, that's not bad. Ah, uh, what do we want next? I'm not sure. 
what we'll learn from these autopsies, but we should probably do them. We've got the bodies now. Uh... Yeah, do it. Also, I'm sure you can make the connection yourself. We've designated this particular specimen as a floater. Lovely. The research team is continuing in its efforts to determine how the aliens prevented the organic tissue from rejecting the mechanical components, as they seem to work in perfect harmony with one another. That thing is twisted as fuck. It also looks like it was once humanoid. So that'll take six... Commander, Ooh. our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Yes, please. To the situation room. Uh, let's just use it to reduce panic somewhere. North America really doesn't need it, unfortunately. Brazil could sure use it. Do we get the We Have Ways bonus immediately? No, we don't. We need to have one over both Argentina and Brazil. We Have Ways would be nice. Anyway, I'm going to do it over Brazil surely, purely for anti-panic reasons. Although Japan will pay us a ton. We could focus our efforts there. Uh, that's the question. Japan will pay us more, and- I think the engineering team is getting antsy. They might be more excited about the new weapons than our troops are. Uh... To mention, it'll be tough to actually do anything about UFOs over here, which increases the chances of the satellite getting shot down. So, do we focus? It's 20 less XCOM bucks. Oh, we're gonna go for Brazil. Immediately reduces their panic. Immediately reduces their panic in that area. That's good. Africa is slowly losing its shit. Brazilian officials offer no effect. No response. Oh. Yeah, people are freaking out. Time passed. Excavation complete. What'd you learn from the autopsy? Defense Matrix Dodge. Oh great. We actually learned more. We learned more from the autopsy than the interrogation. Alright, begin the autopsy please. The tall one has, up until this point, been unofficially referred to as the Thin Man. Initial testing has revealed a concerted effort by the aliens to modify this specimen's genetic structure in such a way as to make it appear human. However, on closer inspection, they seem to have had some trouble concealing the eyes which appear to be reptilian in nature. Well, three days and then we'll finally start analyzing that freaking Outsider shard. Scanned it. Breaking news at this uh -oh. hour. Reports from around the globe indicate a shift in the alien phenomena now affecting cities worldwide. We're now receiving word of outright attacks. Looks like they've changed their tactics. But why? Why do this? It's a message to the entire world that nothing can stop them.
It's time, everybody. Well, uh, terror missions allow us to radically reduce panic depending on how we do. <laughs> it's time. They're coming. You know who I'm talking about. And if you don't, you'll learn. Fuck me. Who do we got? I want everything we've got. This new body armor was developed using what we've learned from the alloys employed in the alien ship. It should prove to be both lighter and stronger than anything we've used in Good. the past. Just in time. HP. Now at 11. Not bad. I usually like to give the heavy the med pack. Okay. Shame Mr. Hadad's not here. Everybody else. Active one day. Return to duty even though they're slightly wounded. Little bit of the old inventory management is still here. 
Svetlina, you wouldn't have to have. It used to be you could sort out who was active duty by who had armor or not. And you just take the armor off people who weren't active duty. This one? I'm almost certain he doesn't have it. dealing with enemies that can one-hit kill you, so really the thing is not letting them get close. That's really the thing here. Also moving quick, civilians are in danger. Okay, let's see here. The frag grenade can kill, can inflict three damage. Arc thrower, use permission. It doesn't affect robotic enemies. I think that'll be an important ability this time. Okay. I am scared shitless. I just am. But we have no other option but to go for it. Yes, even with our badass loadout, I'm still rather scared. Prepare for deployment, strike one have an opportunity here. Brazilian authorities have requested our help, so that's where we're going next. We've gotten reports of alien activity taking place in a densely populated urban center. We should move to secure the area and minimize further okay. civilian casualties. Terror attack in progress. These civilians will try to run away. But... It's still gonna be dangerous as fuck for us. It just will be. Central, this is Big Sky. Confirm signal uplink. Strike team is in position near the terror site. I see Awaiting civilians. Confirmation. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one has been given the green light. Your highest okay. priority is to protect those civilians. This is a very... Okay, we're on one corner of the map. I like it. I like it a lot. We move slowly and deliberately. There's a lot of civilians here if we can get to them. first couple turns will typically have the worst casualties because your team's out of position. Well, if it's half cover we've got, then it's half cover we've got. Go to Overwatch. Paula. Sprint in there. Get the civilians. Start getting the civilians anyway. That is a map edge. Vanish. 
Vandal, get into position. Please don't be something there. I will be completely broken up. Okay, so it's very likely we'll have enemies here. You can't fire this turn anyway. So just get yourself in good cover. Everyone should get themselves in good cover. This was not how I expected to start my first round. And in fact, I'm rather worried. Nothing? Oh. I hear something. You hear that? I hear something from that direction. Understandable. Civilian over there. Okay. Harris. Start getting the civilians out. Fire? No. Please don't. Let's evacuate what civilians we can first off. Why are you just standing around? Go! Okay. Harris, we're covering you. Move. That's the dumbest way to go. Well, if it counts... Oh, they're all right there. Interesting. Okay, Harris is in extreme danger. Gotta save these people. Loco. That hydrant provides you nothing. Nothing and we lose. Good day, sir. Okay, keep it cool. That counts as dashing. I don't know why. Okay, full cover inside the building and we can start helping people. Yeah, I like it. Overwatch, please. Well, you're our assault specialist, so... Alright, dash to get in there with the civilians. Okay, that's... That's an edge of the map. over there. You hear that? Guys? Almost. Stay cool everyone, stay cool. Stay cool, Harris. Get up there, read back that one. Why are you just standing around? Go! She's actually standing in fire in this you know? Move it. Well, good job letting the aliens know we're here. Well, they must have heard us breaking through anyway. What was that? What was that sound? Good question. The fact that he, the fact that she just heard someone. Okay, the more civilians we evac, the more panic we reduce. Evans, can you dash over there? Ah. Uh, Did you maybe get in there? Okay. Get to the ship and keep your head down. Okay, good. 
So the enemy is likely to come at us from two different directions. Post you to Overwatch. Vandal, you can get there. Go, you're safe. Go. By the numbers, everyone. By the numbers. Would it be better to post her in that direction? I'm not sure, actually. Maybe it would have been better to get the civilians with her. Right over there. They spotted us on their turn. Nice. Excellent. No longer a threat. Enemy is still alive. What's making that noise? Ah! Oh wow, did the civilian run? Holy shit. Ones that aren't dumb. I hear them. What's making that noise? I think I know. I saw a civilian taking cover. Okay, first off. First off, how do you not see them? That's my question. How does nobody see the floaters? And how does nobody have a line on them to shoot? Nobody at all see the floaters. Positive enemy contacts. Nice. We're allowed to do that without cutscenes. Wow, fuck you. You're safe now. Go, go, go. save the better. Wow. How do you not have a line to shoot him? This is a this is a question I have actually. Tell me you can shoot him. No? Would you tell me why not? Well the car's already burned out, so there's that. And it's the edge of the map. Now we see him. Now I'm wishing I had grenades. Oh, critical hit. Excellent work. I'm falling back. right next to civilians, which means we either do this or, or the civilians die. 